Hi you guys, Danielle Lindsay, founder of The T-Bar Method here. I am just threw in a halo band, hidden crown, um, one track piece of hair extension that's on a weft that we do sell. That's become very popular because it literally takes two minutes to throw in. There's this little clear band that you like can't even see even if I'm like digging for it that wraps around your head and acts like a headband and then the weft is attached onto it. This was a great invention, great for anybody that wants to add length. However, my whole thing about the T-bar method is it needs to, hair extensions need to fit your lifestyle. So, I haven't done as many videos about our T-bar band, which I wanted to show you the difference and the reason why we've added T-bar T -bar section to um, a band, a halo, um, a hidden crown, whatever the name is that you want to put out there, um, is you've got these in, okay, but it's very loose. It shifts a lot. So, you know, it's somebody grabbing your hair because it's long and like getting stuck behind a seat. You could lose it really easily. And then my thing is, I'm a mom. I like to work out. I have different things going on, so my hair isn't down most of the time. So, when you're trying to put this up, it comes out when you're going in a ponytail. It's just not very secure at all. So it's definitely not fitting your lifestyle. It's definitely something that's more for like a photo shoot. Um, I wouldn't even recommend going to the club in these type of things um, from dancing just because they're not very secure. I have seen where they put clips on the back which help make it more secure but it still makes it really hard to put up in a ponytail because it's grabbing that way and it's not hinging very well up top. And so any updos is really gonna make it difficult. So what we have added is just two little T-bars. I've simplified it um, onto the system. I'm just converting it right now. So we're adding our T-bars. I'm adding the loopers so I can um, install them when I do it. And that's just gonna help it be more secure. So the T-bar band is definitely our most affordable hair extension set. Um, number one reason is because you don't need to wash these because you can remove them every night because they're so simple. Just like a halo would be or a halo band or a hidden crown, any of those names you want to call it. We call it the T-bar band because it's definitely a band. There's a string attached. We've got that going. So I'm just trying to pull this through like I would a normal halo. Excuse, my hair is still curly and my extensions are straight. So if you see these two little kind of antennas coming out, those are the loopers. That's going to thread your hair through the bead if you're new to the T-bar band. So what you're gonna do is you're gonna find the hair here and pull it up just so you can get it out of the way. I'm gonna use a clip right here. And we're just trying to anchor the two sections down so you don't have to feel as paranoid that they're going to fly out. So then all I'm gonna do is I'm going to take a section of my hair that's too much right here. Like this. And you're just gonna do the two T-bars right there. And there's the troubleshoot that I just ran into. As I was having um, the two things is the loopers can get wrapped around the T-bar and when I was combing my hair, pulling it out from the band, it got looped around so I just re, with my hands, put the looper in front of the T-bar and so those are the two troubleshooting that or you're trying to force too much hair through the bead. And so you can see it does happen but it's very easy to fix and then you're going to take your pliers that are included in every T-bar band set and you're going to clamp it shut. Crimp it shut, excuse me. So pull it up to the scalp and crimp it shut. And the beads are silicone lined. So there's one attachment on there. And we're gonna go to the other side. I'm just gonna put a little bit more hair so it stays hidden well. 
And I want to make sure the band is nice and tight because that's just going to make you feel more comfortable like you're not going to lose it at your grocery store or anything that you do. So yes, this does take just a little bit longer than installing the normal band, but you're going to have such peace of mind and you're not going to fret or worry about it flying out and then you'll still be able to do things like putting them up in a ponytail and get enough hair in there so then it can actually hold it and as you can tell um, I still have the band in so the weight of the hair is relying on the band and what makes the T-bar so great in every one of our systems is it sits on top of the weft and so it's creating a hinge. It's not like um, clip-ins. They are trying to do two things at once. Clip-ins are inside and so that makes it so it doesn't hinge as well. That, and so it's going the opposite direction. Okay, but I don't feel like that got up tight enough, so I'm going to retighten it. And there aren't any edits on this thing. I just want you to see like it in full action. Okay, so I just tightened it, opened it, and then retightened it. So we're just gonna put that back down. And literally the band's still on there, so the weight of the hair isn't on these two beads. The beads are just acting as anchors. And then the band is right there. Okay, so this is going to allow me to put it up in a ponytail a lot easier. You just have to play around with it, but you're going to make it feel secure and you're not going to rely on that string to do that and it's still hidden back there. So let me get into reasons why it's the most affordable method. It's because of the hair. With it going in and out every day, you don't need cuticle Remy hair. Um, you just need Remy hair because that can hold through washes, but you don't need to wash these more than once a month if you're taking them in and out. Um, always make sure you take them out before you hop in the shower and wash your natural hair, uh, just because the weight of it, you just don't want to cause damage with blow drying and everything like that that can pull on it and cause more stress on it. So take it out nightly or I have people that just go two or three days before they wash their hair then they take it out um, to do that as well but that makes it the most affordable is because you don't need that cuticle Remy hair and we've got it in the band we've got it in 105 grams which that's what this is my hair is really thin or um, the 145 grams which I always it always just blends a little bit better my hair is really thin and I haven't on it, but it goes in. It has we have the 16 inch, the 18 inch, and then the 20 inch for the halo band, um, and the t to and to also in the T bar band. So, anyways, there you go. There's the tutorial on there, and it's just making it so it's anchored on there for you, so you feel more secure that it's not going to fall apart. All right, thank you so much. Bye bye.